Uh, good afternoon, Superintendent Martin, trustees, overworked staff, and <laughs> certainly members. I'm here not to incite anger and division. We have had enough of that. I'm here to appeal to your sense of goodness. All across the United States, San Diego, San Diego included, we have suffered through an era that will be known someday as the reign of error in public education. It has been a truly gloomy period for children, parents, educators, administrators, and support staff. What our association is proposing in our 5 for 5 campaign can be seen as a bright path away from the demonization and minimization of public school educators that has taken place over the past 15 years. I think I can speak for all educators when I say that we are and have always been about lifting up and bettering the lives of every student who has, through the years, passed through our classroom. We have never been about labeling children as either advanced, proficient, basic, below basic, or far below basic. These demeaning terms have been imposed into our discourse, and it has been demoralized. The language of marginalization must be stamped out. I hope and pray that with our proposals, you can see that we hope to begin building what has been torn down since the implementations of No Child Left Behind and its ugly stepbrother, Race to the Top. We educators work with children to build up the lives of every human being involved in the process of education. In my classroom, students have names, 29 of them. Lily, Georgina, Abraham, Viviana, Carlos, Jerome, Sakura, JC, Carlos, Talia, Layla, Lily, Alexa, Nastasia, Brandon, Felix, Malaya, Joanna, Michaela, Josue, Elisa, Martin, Sarai, Stephanie, Cruz, Andres, John, Rose, and Lucas. That is why I'm here before you today. Thank you very much.